If you push SCP-173 out of a plane while it's flying through the air, can he course correct and zoom back up into the plane? Or is he unable to move while in freefall? The SCP Foundation does a lot of cross-testing between SCPs, but what about testing SCPs outside of their cells and in different environments? What is SCP-457 like in space? How would SCP-173 react if we sent him to Mexico? Should I take SCP-096 for long walks around the block? Why do most SCPs exist as land-based creatures? With 71% of the world being water, statistically speaking, there should be way more than like a couple dozen aquatic SCPs. And why are they almost all world-ending water noodles? Where's the talking Dungeonese crab or magic stingray that can fly in and out of water or something? We need the SCP Foundation. And this commenter wants to know, what would an SCP anime be like? After you subscribe, tell me.